Hello Aquarius, this is your reading for June 2019. This is for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. If you guys are new, welcome. <clears throat> Please like, share, subscribe, comment. Let's see you guys. What energy is around my Aquarius? What energy around Aquarius right now? Six of Swords. This is your card here. I feel like there's something that you're trying to work out with someone um, in regards to past issues, trying to push past uh, some situations, some misunderstandings here. Um, I feel like whoever the female um, is in the situation or the the feminine energy is in a situation is really being passive in this situation and I feel like the the masculine energy is guiding this conversation or or is guiding like how the um, communication is going it's initiating things they are the driving force like it's almost like the male has more at stake. Almost like they need to prove themselves in a sense here. Now, what's challenging you guys or crossing you here is the moon energy. This is for you guys to actually put everything out on the table. Your feelings. Okay. Um, yes, it's, it's, it's wonderful to have an open honest communication going on um, but you also need to be very very clear about how you are feeling as well so um, I feel like there is a need to open up as far as you know how you guys truly feel about each other be very very clear about what it is that you want and what it is that you need okay let's see what the underlying issue is here the Knight of Wands. Um, I feel like there's been a lot of flakiness before with this person. Um, Sagittarius energy, I feel. Let's see. I'm trying to move these cards down so they'll be in view. Um, but there's been a lot of um, back and forth, in and out energy. So there needs to be transparency in the situation and I feel like that's been the issue before is the fact that you guys were not on the same page you guys did not discuss discuss everything that excuse me that you expected of the other person each other okay <clears throat> let's see what was going on in the recent past in the five of pentacles somebody feeling very hurt Somebody put, be, feeling put out, um, left out, feeling rejected here, okay? Feeling like they were not wanted, feeling alone, okay? Like um, whatever they were um, going through, that it was not felt by the other person. It was not acknowledged by the other person here. And I feel like that is something that you guys are discussing here in this situation okay I feel like the male counterpart is actually feeling a lot more um, like they have something to get off of their chest they have something that they need to fix in this situation but I'm getting that both of you guys really felt hurt and put off in this situation here okay so there's a need to open up and express your feelings Let's see your crowning thoughts here. The Knight of Swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, energy here. You want to be able to expressly say what's on your mind, what it is that you need, what it is that you expect, and you want to say it without an apology. You want to say it without feeling bad about it later. 
you want to speak the truth in this situation and you also want the truth spoken to you but you want this from here on out it's like okay this happened in the past yeah okay and if you tell me certain things I expect for you to carry it forward in the future okay let's see what's coming in for you guys here what's coming in for my Aquarius the nine of swords this is a lot of overthinking um, this is thinking things that may not necessarily be the case things may not be the way that you are um, thinking that they are an overactive imagination worrying basically for no reason okay and maybe it's because things you know are still very unclear here because this needs to be worked out how you guys really feel how this person really feels do they want to be you know all in with you they're not going anywhere they're not leaving anymore um, they want a committed relationship and not one where it's just very kind of phallic you know so that needs to be worked out so you know these thoughts won't invade your mental space let's see as Aquarius viewing the situation currently and we have a Hierophant here I feel that you know you guys want something very traditional you don't want a sexual relationship you don't want for somebody to tell you that I'm all in today and then tomorrow they're gone. You don't want somebody that's flighty. You want something very traditional. Something that you can hang your hat on basically. Something solid. Something committed. Taurus energy. What is the influence for my Aquarius? the five of wands you're very conflicted very conflicted something's going on within you guys I feel this is Leo energy here um, and I think you know I it's because there's a lot that you guys you're discussing things I feel or either you will be discussing things but everything needs to be discussed about how much time you need from this person. Um, how much action, what do you need to do? How can we be on the same page? It, it's like it needs to be specific things that are laid out for you guys. I'm feeling that somebody really needs to be reassured in this situation. Really needs to be reassured. And it may be both of you. Because I'm, again, I'm getting that. Both of you feel hurt and put off by the other one. But there's still a lot of conflict between the two of you because somebody's holding something in um, and not just like letting everything be known. And I'm thinking it's for fear that the person's going to turn and leave again. Okay. The hopes or fears of my Aquarius. Seven of Wands. Hmm. You're hoping that you can stand your ground. You're hoping that you can stand your ground when it comes to this situation and what it is that you need in your life. What's going to make you happy? What needs to be done to make you happy? And not give in for, you know, for fear of losing this person or losing this person again or, you know, keeping this person away. Some of you want this person to actually... Um, 
clear the air with them but I don't see some of you like necessarily wanting this person back for real because I'm getting that for a lot of you there's too much water under the bridge for you and you cannot let certain things go it's what I'm getting let's see what the outcome is for you guys for this month what is the outcome for my Aquarius Then we have the lover's energy here. You guys definitely love this person. Whoever this is, this is Gemini energy. You definitely love this person. But what I'm getting is that for some of you, it's like it's them or me. Okay. I could give in. I could get back with this person because they want to. Um, but will I be truly happy here? Has too much been said? Has too much been done for me to be able to get over it? I definitely am feeling like there is um, there is uh, an undeniable connection, a physical connection even here. But somebody's been very, very hurt. I see both of you have been hurt, but I feel that one of you is really not able to let go. And move on and move forward with the other one so there is definitely a choice that I feel like you guys are um, having to make in the month of June a very very important choice okay so Gemini Libra Aquarius energy um, is here for you guys Pisces um, Taurus I feel Sagittarius Leo is strong here okay so that's what I have for you guys, and I'll be speaking with you soon.